Skin pigmentation is something a lot of people suffer from and it can make those who suffer from it feel quite self-conscious. So pigmentation is basically the discoloration of the skin. As you may well know, skin color is made up of melanin. Pigmentation occurs when there's a strong concentration of melanin or skin pigment in the one area. So it can be caused by a number of different reasons. The number one reason here in Australia is the sun and its damaging UV rays. Other causes can also be skin trauma, hormones, certain medications, or congenital. This can either occur in patches of the skin or a complete area. Luckily, there are a number of ways to treat skin pigmentation. And it's important to note that for minor skin pigmentation, there are a number of home remedies that have been proven to be a great help. So then there are topical creams that do require a doctor's prescription, as they are known to be quite powerful. Secondly, then you have depigmentation peels or masks that your skin therapist has to perform for you again because they're quite powerful. And third, and certainly not least, there are a number of laser treatments and or IPL. Laser treatment for pigmentation works with the dark color of the particles in the pigmentation, which absorbs the laser light. The laser light is then converted to heat and the temperature of these particles is then raised and the laser heat burns them. This burn pigmentation either works its way to the surface of the skin and the skin sheds it or it is absorbed by the deeper layers of the skin. Now, this might sound like it could burn or be quite painful, but it's only been described as being similar to a light flick with a rubber band. So it's not too bad for the great results that it's proven to have. For a more in-depth look at how these laser treatments work, take a look at the article attached, or to find a clinic that is near you, click the Find a Clinic tab. So if you still have further questions, don't hesitate to email me at help at wickedbeauty.com.au and I hope this information's given you a little bit of insight into skin pigmentation.